Hello, all you guys and girls out there in the eBay reselling world. It is I, the Turkey Ford Wolfman, coming back at you with a haul video Monday morning. Plus what sold? We sold five since Saturday at 12. I have too much stuff in here. Death pile growing, Captain. <laughs> so I hit my favorite Goodwill Sunday, 1 p.m., well, I got there at 110, but still, I got to the board game aisle before anybody else. Yeah, it was awesome. I know. We'll open these up real quick. Here's the head of the video. It's listed on Wolfman's goodies for a few bucks. I don't know. Is it the musical group, the city, Chicago Bulls? <laughs> it's a universal hat. Chicago Fire Department. Whatever you want it to be. There it is. We'll put that in rolling cart. Box A. Yes. All right. I know. Right. Uh, wake up. 11 a.m. Well. I got my wife a couple of dolls. Okay. Because they was vintage. This one uh, takes two C batteries. And the only listing I saw was $30. It was the actual sold comp for 30 bucks. By the way, she's washing its outfit. Yeah, wakes up and stuff. Uh, it says mu a voice box does not work. Well, this one does work, and it doesn't say anything. It, its head just moves around like that. Oh, I could turn it on. There you go. No speaker. Get your thumb out of your mouth, baby. Made in the USA. So once she cleans the outfit, she's going to say that uh, it works and uh, she's going to copy that sold comp for $30 and probably bump it up to 40 Because we got offers anyway, you know. Here's a vintage one. I thought it was Holly. Holly Hobby. <clears throat> 1973. That's not the original outfit. No, that's one grandma made for her. You know, so. You gotta buy the wife something. That's what's sold. Here's a sign that the boys donated to me. He said he didn't want it hanging in his room no more. Well. We'll just sell it. I don't know where to put you. There you go. This is awesome. There are several sold comps. Several. 40, 45, 50 bucks. This one's new with tags. There's some sold comps new with tags. I'm not going to mash the button because I'll get a copyright strike. It's singing the song. Press my paw. We're hooked on the feeling. Yeah. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to list them and say uh, the fish's mouth is intermittent. Fish tries to sing. He sings just fine and dances around. But I've tried everything. That's what I love. You know? And I'm gonna do what my wife did and put a video on uh, eBay somehow. Click the video button and record them working. Or half working. That, that, that. Is it time? Oh, there's the preview hat. Oh, by the way, we sold hat number five today. So I marked it off. Real team. I mean, uh, team real tree. Dang, the dyslexia. <coughs> Excuse me. Got this for a couple bucks. I thought it was awesome. I mean, there ain't so comps. It's all over the place. You know, they're about a dollar a piece. New and sealed. They don't match. No, but they are sealed, right? I'm going to lot them up. And this is the first time in five years I've been doing this. Is that even upright? I mean, I pick these up for VCR all the time. I have several backups. I sell them. But I've never seen a head cleaner for a cassette tape. So I'm going to put it with it. It wasn't a lot of, it wasn't worth a lot of money. You know, sold comp wise. I'm gonna lock that up for like say fifteen dollars plus shipping. 
and <laughs> you've seen me sell these games, you know. All games are a dollar. It was the first day where we didn't have bags, plastic bags at the local Goodwill. So I just leave all these in the buggy and say, look, I'll bring the buggy back. I got 11 board games and she's just like, 11 it is. Ah, oh, one, two, three are still sealed. So there, didn't look none of this up. I put three things back. Yes, I did. And one was uh, a board game with a cartoon character. It's, uh, stay in your briefs. He's got boxer briefs on. I thought it was going to be worth some money and it had sold comps around four and five dollars. So I put it back. There's one I never saw before. <laughs> I've sold this one before. Yeah, what is it? Chris Chrissy or whoever that magician is. 1996. Completed. My wife was in here checking all this out. Yeah, got the dice. Cards. I don't know how much that is worth. Never saw this before in my life. A minute to learn. A lifetime to master. <laughs> I don't know. It's 96, I believe. 1990. That's some sophisticated checkers or chest or something. <laughs> Ethel. <laughs> oh, look, it's got a pool table. Uh, felt on it. Well, oh, that's complete. And then there's five loose ones right there. Oh, and you play that shuffleboard stuff. There you go. Do we have instructions? And hundred dollar bills. What? Got coupons, and we have instructions. <laughs> Didn't look it up. Should I? Nah. I'm in the board games. <clears throat> this one, I did look up. It sells. Haul video slash shipping out plus some lame dad jokes. I'm going to have to find another book. Oh, that's complete. Death Pile. Eh? Get down there. My nephew has got several hundreds, if not a thousand or two, pocket knives. And he is selling on his own eBay account. So he comes over here in the evening and ships out. But uh, it's Austin underscore something is his eBay store. I'll have to share that later. But that's pretty cool. This is sealed. That's the only reason why I got it. For ages eight and up, start that gabbling, gabbling habit early. Yeah. Got the go handle, right? So you can take it to school and get kicked out. <laughs> I never saw a battleship box this big before. Like this one. I've sold the big old one from the 80s, and it was a big box. But I'm like, why is that not going down? I mean, look at it. It can't cover the whole thing up. I hope this is complete. Live. Looks Bluetooth. Instructions. Have y'all ever saw that one? <clears throat> I didn't look it up for a dollar, you know. I'll take a chance. I'll part it out. Worst case scenario. Oh, those go a certain way. Yes, they do. And that does too. Well, look at that. That's a big board. Four AA batteries not included. I don't know. Looks pretty cool. 
you got air missiles there you go this one uh they have a several of these trivial pursuits they'll be in a tin box or a cardboard i looked at this one make sure it was complete and i did a sold comp oh it's got a care bear from the 80s and uh the 1980s one does sell i mean there is back to the future on the board what is that thing a dell computer got the old school one cd laser disc nah that's beyond that oh there's instructions got worried there for a second can't get big money for it if it's not complete i think it's 20 to 30 bucks <laughs> Excuse me. Operation. <laughs> the barn is full of these. I get the pieces out of them. Oh, this one looks to be complete. If it is, I'll throw it on. Instructions. Oh, no. Battery compartment's gone. So what I do is I can go get this exact one. It's got a clean battery compartment. And then I'll have a complete game, hopefully. It eat a hole in the cardboard, the acid did. That's my little foot wiping mat that I just dumped that cardboard acid out on. Yeah, that's good stuff right there. Always leave the batteries in all your toys before you put them up for the winter, summer, whenever you quit playing with them. A Monopoly light blue. The world's most popular board game. Wow, it's got extra pieces. No way. Two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. Is it supposed to have eleven? Eleven charms. I don't know. <clears throat> Excuse me. That was surprisingly uh, organized. No kids got to it before I could to shake it up. I mean, look at it. Will you look at it? Eleven. I see four. I could read here. 11 tokens. Well, it's that's one that comes with 11, so you, 11 of you can play it for two days. But there's that. The whole video. Let's see what sold. I don't know what to do. There you go. <laughs> Knock a bear out with your hammer there, buddy. <laughs> Going down. Be sure and watch uh, Reseller Island Podcast. You'll learn something. Yes. Sunny Las Vegas and J-Ride Flips Podcast there. All right, I'm signed into my account, and I've sold three. So we've sold five for a total of $99.90. <laughs> I've sold three for $60.13. A vinyl record and a hat. If the third thing was a coffee cup, that'd be right up my alley. <laughs> Typical sales for a Monday. Media mail selected. Surf and Drag, LP, Beach Boys, Trashman, RIP, Chords, Marquettes, Hundales. I got $12 for it, and it's going to Marty in Texas. Thank you so much, Marty. We appreciate you. I thought it was awesome, dude, when I seen this. 19 and 78 CBS records. 
Oh, it's not available. I put it in the right way. Mm-hmm. All right, we'll put that in the 13, one 13 record box. <clears throat> Backing up. Here we go. Dun 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 dun. <laughs> Copyright. That's the place to be right there. Corona extra beer hat blue strap back baseball cap adjustable. That's my title. Nine dollars and twenty three cent. Maybe an offer. It's going to the Kohler family overseas. It's international shipping, so it's going to Illinois, eBay International Boulevard. Ground Advantage. And is there not a button right here? I didn't realize that. My apologies. You click on the buyer here. Wow, Switzerland. <laughs> we're we're going to ship a hat to Switzerland. So we're going to pay $5 to get it to eBay International Shipping Hub. They're going to open it up and look for contraband and fill out the, you know, custom sheets. And eBay's going to ship it to Switzerland. Man, that's awesome. Oh, I'm done messed up now. Close that page out. Yep, Kohler family. Thank you so much. We appreciate you. See, that's how it works. There's not always a Walmart or, you know, a store around the world for people to go and buy stuff. So you put your product on there at a decent price, turn on international shipping, and then you'll sell more items. Wow, what if they would have been number six and they're like, what are we going to do with American money? <laughs> What's this Hot Wheel or this uh, G.I. Joe guy? Oh, I got some new ones. Toy drawer. What did I get recently? Oh, it's the McDonald's turtles. Yeah. Throw one of them in there. Look at that guy. He drank too much coffee this morning. <laughs> got a bag of them left over from the flea market. But anywho... Backing up. Scrolling down. I have had these listed for two years. It's so neat how when you first list something, it's showing up on top and you'll sell two or three. And then it's years later. A lot of four Ernie Keebler Elf mini beanbag doll. Five inches tall, new in the bag, and always oh, cute. I got $6.80 plus shipping. And it's going to Ruth and MN. I better look. Minnesota. Thank you so much, Ruth. We appreciate you. Ground Advantage. I'll put that in a 644. Got a whole box of them, so you got a lot up for. I thought four was pretty cool. Put in a little box. Yeah. Multiples. Make it rain. All right, let's, uh, nah, let's go right here. This has power. <sighs> Hadn't charged it in a while. And it's dead. Good job, Chad. <laughs> there you go. Put that on charge. Let's back up to the normal system here. We'll sign into my wife's account. See what she sold and then ship them out. Two items. The heat just come on, by the way. <clears throat> My apologies. Clicking on Melissa's Thrifty Barn. Here we go. On a Monday. One more click. Two more. Drink coffee. Good job. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Excuse me. Two items totaling $39.77. Good job, honey. She sold a doll for $14 with accessories. 
$20 total. Boxy Girls 8 inch doll Willow J at Play Purple with Pet and Accessories. $14. Going to the Joseph family in Texas. Thank you so much. Yes, we appreciate you. Oh, she's got that all locked up. Oh, I see a baby bottle, sippy cup, some kind of little animal, hairbrush, or a ping pong paddle. Right there. She's had that one listed for two years. Which we may have relisted it and sell similar. Not sure. I'm trying to do 50 at a time. A lot of two Captain America Civil War movie theater souvenir cups. Avengers from 2016. She got $15.99. And it's going to Tommy in New Mexico. Pretty sure that's where you're at here, buddy. Yep. Thank you so much. Yes. Isn't that cool? Who would have thunk it? Oh, it's got 2016 and Marvel on them. Aha! What is that? Yep, we gotta put that in the 1086. E the 50 cent box. We're done. Short weekend. All right. We can do this. Glasses, check. Book, gone. <laughs> okay, boys and girls out there in the reselling community. It is I, Chad, with a dad joke. There's a pencil. I don't see check marks. Don't see anything. I hope y'all had a great weekend. I know I did, for reals. Even though it rained yesterday and it's cold. Yeah, by the way, it's about 55 degrees. It's going to be 63 for the high. Wind's blowing. And it's 68 in here. So stay warm, my friends. <clears throat> okay. My wife and kids are leaving me because of my obsession with horse racing. And they're off. They're packing and there they go. <laughs> you know, I think it's your turn to pick wild mushrooms, my girlfriend said. So I gather. That one flies halfway over my head. I love being a grandparent in retirement. I give my grandkids a lot of sugar and then I leave them with their parents to deal with them. It's so true. Good morning, workmate. Being around you has inspired me to find another job. <laughs> is that a compliment or an uh, insult? It could be either. I always wanted a life like a Disney princess. I should have specified not the part where they are stuck at home cleaning the whole day. Love is very complex matter of chemistry. And that's why my partner treats me like toxic waste. Nope. Man, I'm going to have to prove for you days. Love is a lot like peeing your pants. Only you can feel the warm sensation from such an experience. Uh, 
I'm going to X that one. Check that one. My kids won't eat their tacos for dinner, so I had to throw them out. Then I ate their tacos. And I'm done. We must ship out. I hope y'all have a great day. Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And share with your friends and family. You never know. I might go buy something else and show it tomorrow. Do a half haul video. But, uh, see you later. Bye.